Hi, I'm Ben Dakin, Best Supermarket Spy, and here I am for episode four of my Whiz Round, the best of the Christmas shows. I'm picking the best three. Best three buys from this year's Supermarket's Christmas show. So this is my pick number one of the Morrison's Christmas show. It's a turkey Christmas crown. And we've got Roy here who's going to explain just why this should be the centerpiece of your Christmas dinner. This is the finished product. Um, it is essentially turkey breast meat, which is made up of the turkey breast lobe. We cut the breast lobe, we trim it of any uh, skin and gristle. That goes into a frame that we make out of pork ribs, which is pretty much like that. We trim off the top inch of meat on there. We place the turkey breast meat in the centre. We then add Morrison's own recipe, pork, sage and onion stuffing mix. Spread that evenly over the top and then lay out four slices of Morrison's smoked streaky bacon and just garnish with a little sprig there. And the beauty of this product is it actually cooks the way the pork ribs insulate the meat or stop the turkey breast meat drying out. The stuffing stops all the steam rising out again, ensuring that the turkey crown or the turkey breast meat in this crown stays moist and sucking. So there you go, you've got no worries about overcooking your wings, about your dry breasts. You've got a lovely moist turkey, serves about six to eight, and it's available in store to pick up from your local Morrison's. It's going to be handmade by their butchers in store. This is my pick number two pick of the show. It's a Morrison's reindeer bread. I love Morrison's Bakery and I go, I travel there just for the Polish bloomer and they've always got great bake fresh in store. This is one, a new one to the edition for Christmas. Mine's going to talk us through it. Adapted from last year from our candy cane bake, we've taken the chocolate chip brioche dough, some more butter in it, plenty of chocolate chips for our younger customers. We've had a bit of feedback that they're not into our mixed fruit varieties and mixed peels, so we thought just chocolate, chocolate. Chip, just chocolate. Safe, you're on a safe foot in there, just so chocolate. I've just got a nice dough here, and you can just see by the dough the amount of chocolate chips that are in the product. You know, there is a vast amount, and I've still got to mix these last few weeks through. But what we've done today, just to emphasise to you guys that we do make from scratch, we've actually brought the ingredients and we've mixed them by hand. Today. So you can see that this is what we do in store. You know, we're not bought in, we're on scratch made. I've mixed the dough and then we've challenged some of the journalists to uh, have a go putting a product out and we've had some cracking uh, responses. So we've got a product there that's ready to go into the oven. So I'll go down and bake this for about 10 or 15 minutes and then I'll have a finished item like that. I think Rudolph's going to uh, feature on many a Christmas table this year. <laughs> Scarborough. Oh, it's Scarborough. Number three pick of the show for Morrison's this Christmas is this. It's a little cake pop made with cornflakes in the shape of a Christmas tree. And the best of all, you make them yourselves. Well, you get your kids to make them and then you sit back and eat them. It's up to you. I'm here with Graham. Graham's man's going to tell us all about why this should be your Christmas stocking this Christmas. So, the kit box itself comes like this. We launched it last year, it was a huge success. And in that box, you've got everything you need to do it. So it's really dead easy. So you even got your own cornflakes. So, you've got a little, little bag of cornflakes. You've got your little sachet of chocolate. You've got your icing, which is already made. So there's no need to make your icing or anything like that. You've got your, you've got your holders. And the best thing out of this is what we thought when we designed it was um, it's got a stand. Oh. So the stand. Let's just do this over here. Let's see. Then if you just want to put that in there. So when you when you when you actually make that, you know, you get you get the pots. Now you can actually set them in the stand. So you, you make it, you make the chocolate, mix your cornflakes, put your pop in there, set them in the fridge, stand them up, and then we use the stand, and then you can just decorate them as you go. And then you get a little sachet of balls, which you put on.